Hey everybody, Steven here, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Uh, since the last episode, I have put in a few things. Uh, this is the first thing I want to show you guys. This would be the automatic... <laughs> just kidding, it's not automatic. It's just a sugarcane farm. Temporary little uh, decorative project, mostly. It's not really that useful for <laughs> harvesting. It's not very efficient, I should say, uh, at harvesting sugarcane. Uh, if anyone's curious on how this works, let me know in the comments. It's not a huge secret. Um, it's not that hard to figure out. But if you have any questions on it, feel free to ask. I'd be more than happy to make a tutorial on how to do this setup. It, it It's more decorative than anything, and I kind of like how it fills out this space. Instead of just being a mountainside, it has like this cool little pattern on it, which I like. And another thing that I did was I finished off my path. And you'll notice it's a little bit different than it. I had it started out in the last episode, and I like this a lot better than the other one. And I will explain why in a minute. Because over here, <laughs> I've been kind of busy. I was, I, you know how I'm always running out of food? Well, I got to the point where I was basically dying. So I needed to create this farm. And basically I have my source block underneath this uh, crafting table. And since water travels one down, I don't need two source blocks, so basically this entire, it trickles down and it goes out to here. So I basically kind of decorated this and made it a little bit uh, more full. So it, it's kind of natural looking and it's again, it's not an efficient farm, but I, oh, I just crushed that. Uh, it's not an efficient farm, but it is useful. It'll, it'll get me some food and that's all I really needed out of it. So I'll do an efficient one later, but I don't need it right now. And this this is my project chest see if you look in here there's nothing there because uh, from now on in the beginning of the episodes or whenever I cut over to a project I'm gonna go to this chest in this cool little room I did made out of half slabs blah 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 uh, it's just this little pedestal that has this chest on it and everything that I will need for that project will be inside this chest or a chest similar to it like if I'm in the nether I'm not gonna have my nether project in here. I'm gonna have my own nether project test chest project chest in the nether. Uh, a little decorative thing. Because when you make a trapdoor it makes two, so I just put the other one here for no reason. Anyway, so I'm gonna have project chests and that's gonna keep the episodes a little bit more organized. So and, and you'll also see what you need f if you want to emulate the project that I'm doing. So again here's the farm and See, this was kind of my first project chest, except it wasn't in a cool little organized thing. So basically I have uh, this this room, and then the bridge, you notice I brought it down one so I can see over it, and I put these little decorative support beams to kind of hold up the bridge, even though of course they don't do anything other than be decorative. But yeah, it's a lot more walkable, and it's a lot more aesthetically pleasing to me. Plus, it gets you these cool vista points, which the other ones did not. Like, I want to be able to walk over here and have this cool view. And over here, you'll see this forest. And I'm going to do something with that forest. Not this episode, probably. But I'm going to do something cool with that forest. And it'll be it'll be really awesome. I'm not going to tell you what. You're going to have to come back next week and watch. But it'll look really good from here. And then, of course, the uh, path follows around over here. And this is where it's going to wrap over to the chicken farm, which we may be working on somewhat today if I if I can get all the materials that I need for it. There's one thing that's going to be a little tricky that's going to be in the nether, which, spoiler alert, that's what I'm going to try and do today. I hadn't already told you. Anyway, so down here, it wraps around into the tree farm. And that's about it for that. So for this episode... Let's get it started, <laughs> as though it's not already started already. Uh, we're going to go full circle back to here and go down to my strip mine because I found some resources, but I didn't have an iron pickaxe. So I ran and grabbed one and we'll go derp 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 down the stairs. So a lot of things have been going on with the channel lately and uh, some of them are cool, like our subscriber count keeps going up. That's always good, except one thing we hit a little a little flat line on it at 185 we had 185 subs for an entire day and like no increase very very few little feedback and it, it's kind of a little bit demoralizing I'd say anyway so here's a little redstone 
it's not demoralizing per se. I mean, it's more like, ah oh, man, uh, nobody liked our stuff today, or some. I don't know. Not complaining, but uh, it's always it always makes you feel good when when lots of people sub you <laughs> in a day. It, it'll get there. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I finished all the thumbnails. If you go to the channel page and you go to the playlists, you'll notice they all have very beautiful matching thumbnails and I put a lot of work into those and I hopefully you guys enjoy them I'm still totally open to other fans uh, posting or sending us images of possible thumbnails we could use because again we want to be connected to you guys and a fan made thing is always good let's see so we're gonna go do like one more of these and then we'll get get started going in the nether because there's two ways to do another portal first way is to go and mine some obsidian which is kind of hard to do if you don't have diamonds so there's another way which involves these iron buckets so iron buckets as if there was any other kind um, buckets you go and you get lava and then you go and you kind of build a little dirt frame whoa whoa Oh, please be more than one. Oh, please be more than one diamond. I'll get back to what I was saying, because it's still still important. Woo! Oh, oh dear. Don't kill me. <laughs> okay. Wow. Nice. Four diamonds. That's, that's perfect, because that'll let us make an enchant... No. Will it? No. I don't know if it'll let us make an enchanting table. Oh, and another tip, uh, just because you found all of the ones that are connected doesn't mean you found all of the diamonds, so, you know, never hurts to, to dig around it a little bit, or you never know what you might find, like redstone. Anyway, so, as I was saying about, what was I talking about? Oh, the, uh, nether portal. You don't necessarily need diamonds. It helps to have diamonds, but you don't have to have them. Because what you can do is you can build a little frame out of dirt, and you can pour lava, and then you can pour water on top of it and turn the, the lava into obsidian. Uh, and that's basically, you just, if you have lava and you have buckets, you can make obsidian, and you just build it in that frame shape, and then you can light it up, and you don't need diamonds for that. However, we do have diamonds, so I'm going to go... Uh, grab some materials. Actually, I'll just stay on video because I'm basically right next to it. So I'm going to grab some some water. Let's see, do I need, do I have any wood down here? Do, do, do. Yeah. Make some planks. Oops, I'm just wasting inventory space. And then we will make our first done. Hmm. Yeah, we'll use it. <laughs> Enchanting table can wait. Diamond, we'll find diamonds. I'll find diamonds off camera. I already found them on camera for you, so I'll find them off camera later. Uh, and actually, I'm going to cut away because I'm eating up time like crazy, and I'll be right back. Okay, so we are back, and I just ran up there and grabbed some water for, the, for uh, some obsidian making. There we go. I'm just gonna. This is right above my layer for strip mining. So basically, just gonna go pour some water on this lava lake, gather some obsidian. If you didn't know how to make obsidian, that's how you do it. You get water and you pour it on lava source blocks. So I'm gonna dig away at this obsidian, and I'll get back to you guys in just a couple minutes while I, until I get enough. All right, so if you guys look really carefully, you'll notice all my levels are gone. It's a mystery how that happens. I don't know. One minute you're playing around lava, and the next minute you're dead. Not going to give any spoilers as to how I died, but I fell in lava and I died. 
So, this is the new method we will be using to harvest obsidian. See, you go ahead and you make a little, little runner here, right? And then you run over to the lava and you go one, two, three. And you get three lava buckets, right? Right? You run over here, you go one, two, three. And then you go get this water and you go and then you put the water back. And then you go ahead. And that's how we're gonna do it. And I will be right back. Okay, so we got everything that we needed for the obsidian nether portal. And I was trying to stake out a place, like where do I wanna put this portal? I don't want it in my base because I don't want my base to be like evil or like whatever. I want it to be kind of themed. So I wanted it somewhat nearby, but not in my base. So I decided to choose this mountain over here. So I kind of went ahead over here and then zigzagged over here. And then this is the entrance here. And it's not centered, but it will be. And you'll see what I mean later, but I'm definitely not gonna to beautify it now. I'm gonna do that later. All right, so I got my sword in hand and gonna eat up a little bit and we are going into the nether 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 wow okay cool so let's look oh this is gonna be bad I'm gonna get lost because I don't have F3 this is all I need We'll do a little exploring. I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it a little bit. I'm gonna risk a little uh, little little getting lost, risk killing myself. But I will not risk diamonds. You'll notice I'm not uh, carrying anything of the diamond persuasion with me. All right, what's down here? Some more you? Oh yeah. I need a lot of this. Actually, I really don't. I only need like one or two. But I'm going to say I need a lot so that it gives me an excuse to get a lot. If you guys if you guys follow me. I don't. I don't even know what I'm talking about. All right, so where did I come from? <laughs> Anyways. Let's see. I haven't seen any mobs yet. Oh no, I'm just going to get all kinds of lost. All right, and we're going back. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. I almost, I almost didn't know my way. I think it's up that way, but I'm gonna check out over here. Go away. No. So I had an idea. Uh, I had a YouTube channel prior to this for myself. I wasn't partnering up with James. And I was thinking of maybe bringing it back a little bit and featuring it on our channel. So if anybody wants to watch it, they may. But it's not on like a strict schedule. It's not going to be like monetized. It's just going to be videos that I'm doing for fun. And series that I don't want on this channel. I just, they're just, they don't have a place. Like I wanted to do, Animal Crossing is one of my favorite games. So I was going to do maybe like an Animal Crossing series. Animal Crossing City Folk on the Wii, so it'll be kind of like a high quality Animal Crossing uh, playthrough. Ooh, big vein of of whatever this stuff is. Getting experience. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> wow, <laughs> I almost just killed myself again. Although I may have to kill myself because I'm gonna get lost and there'll be no way back. Okay, so we're gonna go back this way. I'm already lost. I don't know where I am. Like, honestly, have no idea. All right, that looks familiar. I was gonna do an Animal Crossing series posted on my other channel. Oh no! Okay. Posted on my other channel. Be like a playthrough. Like whenever I play it, just record here and there, make episodes out of it. See if anybody likes it. I think I need to go this way. Yeah, I remember I almost died here, and I almost died there. And 
Then I go up this way. There we go. Yay! We are gonna get out of here alive! Yes! Wait, I never went up this way. <laughs> Spoke too soon. We might not get out alive. I'm sorry. But if we do die, we won't lose anything like diamond. Okay, fire, lots of fire. Haven't seen any open areas, which is, I haven't seen any pigment. Hello, hard difficulty, where is all the zombie pigment at? Do they not spawn in caves or something? We'll figure it out, we'll get out of here. Eventually, ooh, hello, I see something up there. Gonna get a little bit more another quartz and then we're gonna head on down. So let me go know what you guys think about me doing some other series. I could post more Minecraft on there, since this is only gonna be one a week. I might revisit doing collaborations, because I kind of gave up on those. Um, just because I didn't have a slot for them on my main channel. But I, I might have time for them on another channel. I just... I don't want to spam the sub box, so anybody that's subscribed to Litter Gaming, I don't want them to get like 13 of me po posting my own Minecraft videos. That seems like I'm hogging the channel and it's not mine to hog, so I don't know. I might go ahead and make another post on my other channel. Let me know what you guys think about that, what kind of episodes, playthroughs you'd like to see. Oh, it's dark and rainy. I need to go bed. I already did an all-nighter for you guys. I'm not going to do another one. <laughs> okay, I will. I will do another one, but I won't do it. I won't do it right now. <laughs> I'll do it later. Oh, I got a lot of nether quartz in that short amount of time. I think that might have increased the uh, rate of it spawning. <laughs> hey, buddy, burned to death. Oh, you saw my screen name. Forget it. Uh, da -da -da. All right, so in the next episode, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make this chicken farm functional. And I'm going to do a little little tips and tricks for you. Uh, and then I'll connect it there. And I'll do a tutorial for that. That'll, that's definitely going to be a tutorial video. Uh, I'll do the tutorial first and then second I'll show it in the live game. It'll be cool. It'll be a nice little change up from the regular Let's Play. And... Hmm trying to think what else can I do I could go back to the nether and I could adventure some and then maybe try and dig to a open area maybe look for yeah that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go find this chest over here I'm gonna dump everything that's valuable let's see dump you 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 Alright, so we'll head back to the nether real quick, put this in there, and I'm just going to dig straight upwards until I either burn to death or, let's see, can I burn to death? Yeah. I'm going to either burn to death because there's a lava lake above me, or I'm going to find an open area and hopefully find another fortress, or stronghold, I guess, whatever you want to call it. I'll call it a fortress because I like fortresses more than strongholds. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we're here. We're here. And let's see. I'm going to go as high as I can without digging. Go up here. Go up here. All right. So we'll dig like it's a... What's it called? Jungle tree. A stair step until we either hit bedrock or we find an area above. Woohoo! Oh! I'm free! And there's a pigman. I swear, like, hardbone is broken on here because I never run into that many mobs. Alright, gonna get some more of this stuff. You guys are in for a treat next episode. There's gonna be a lot going on. A lot of farms to be made. And I'll have my uh, project box already for you. Yeah, you. Or it's the chest. The project chest. I'm going to call it the project box. That's easier to say. Project chest. It just does not roll off the tongue. So project box. I'm going to have all the project box items that I need for the chicken farm. Because I need food. I need chickens. I need farms. 
I need eggs. I need, I need lots of stuff. I don't need food. Because I'm sick of eating hay. I mean, it's bread now, but usually it's hay. Alright. Cool. So I think that'll wrap it up for this episode. We'll go get to this uh, edge over here and see what we have in our surroundings. If you enjoyed this episode, uh, sub the channel, of course. Check out the other Minecraft episodes. They are all very good, in my humble opinion. They are just the best videos ever made, in my humble opinion. They are amazing and fantastic, and probably better than most other YouTubers, in my humble. Let me get the... I want to make a point to let you know that this is humble. My humble opinion. I think they're great. So check out the other videos, and I will see you guys next time.